hi guys so welcome back to another video i know you saw the title so let's jump right into it we have a little haul video just a tiny tiny one i know i said i was on a no buy and i still am on a no buy but i needed this stuff so i needed it it was a necessity so let's jump right into it I just did a swatch video. The first up is from e.l.f. So I just did a swatch video. So you'll see the swatch video has already been up. So you'll see that on the new e.l.f. Old Face Satin Lipsticks. And if they come in 10 shades. And I picked up 5 of those 10 shades. So I'll just briefly show you. But if you want to see how they look on my skin tone. How they swatch and all of that. Just check out that video. I'll link it right now. So the first one is Effortless. Then we got Own It. Then we have No Regrets. And No Doubt, which is a new shade. That's what I have on my lips now mixed with a uh, MAC chest Chestnut Lip Liner. And then last but not least is Hustle. So these were all the shades I picked up. Five out of the ten. Check that video out. I can't even remember if they was having a sale. But I think I really went on there to pick up the lipsticks and just ended up picking up some more stuff. So, yeah, these wipes were on sale, though. They had a two-pack makeup remover cleansing cloth. And they were on sale for, like, $4. So, I decided to pick up one. I've never tried Max uh, makeup remover, so why not? Next up is free is a putty primer trio, which y'all know I don't care for the putty primers so I'll end up probably giving this to my cousin it comes with the putty the poreless putty primer matte putty primer and luminous putty primer maybe I need to try the luminous I can't say I've never tried the luminous one yeah I know I've been into luminous primers so wait I don't know uh what is this I think this was free oh yeah so the last time I did an order, I got a free toner, which was this one. So when I placed this order, I liked the toner so much that I got another sample of it. And when I run out of this one, then I'll make sure to order the um, large size. But this is the Pure Skin Toner with Oat Milk, Aloe Juice, and Niacinamide. So I think I was talking about this before my phone was ringing after cleansing apply to skin avoid the eye area and that's what I was doing it's just a real really light toner it doesn't really um irritate my skin it's not strong you know how some toners have that alcohol in it and it kind of burns or it kind of stings this isn't a harsh toner at all so yeah once I finished this oh my camera is like not paying me no attention then i'll order a whatever a big size one i ordered two lip glosses and not quite sure if these are new lip lacquers and one is in the shade wild rose and one is in the shade whisper pink so let's see i've had this before in the clear one these are old but i guess they probably came out with newer shades so this one is a wild rose perfect these are amazing lip lacquers if you're looking for like something this is baby pink if you're looking for something that's affordable but still creamy on the lips this is wild rose i'm not quite sure if you can see it but it's a baby pink to me yeah you can see a little bit it's a baby pink shade and then this one is a whisper pink which is a lighter shade i've been into pinks lately i don't know what it i must be becoming a girl whisper pink this is my nude shade so this would pair perfect with my nude combo lipstick and just put this in the center yeah that'll be great
So this is a whisper paint. You probably can't see it. Let me see if I can move up some because they're right next to each other. But I'm right next to each other, and <clears throat> they are um, very soft in color. If I should say, they're very soft in color, but they will show up on me. You know, it won't be as vibrant because you know this is like a baby paint. Matter of fact, I can put some of this on now. I'm gonna put some of this on now. What is this? That's why my haul videos be so long because. I can't just get to the point. Whisper paint. I'm going to put some whisper paint on in the center. Uh -huh. yeah. Just mess up the wine. Mm -hmm. I used to love this stuff. Uh -huh. Yep, we're good to go. Next, okay, what's next? Last but not least, I picked up, even though I tell y'all all the time, let me wipe this off my hand, I don't like to color correct. You know, Elf came out with four new color correctors, and I picked up two of those color correctors. So I have it in orange and peach. They are $4, and I picked them up. <laughs> somebody who does not like to color correct goes and buys color correct it's like why so this is the peach i was like four dollars i could do something with it so let's see this is the peach shade y'all y'all yeah, probably seen this already but this is supposed to well maybe let me look at what it's supposed to do first okay because i just get to talking to y'all and it's like can you tell us what it's supposed to do? So let's see. I think I have put in lips, but I need to put in like a new products. All new. All new. I see Elf has some new mascara. Not really into Oh, yes. That's what I meant. So we can talk about new products right quick. So they came out with it. It's called Good Vibes Only. And they came out with a quad, an eyeshadow quad. I think how many shades is there? It's two different. Um, And it's $4. It's two different shades. It comes with a brush. Well, it doesn't come. But this set, you can purchase a three brush um, collection or whatever and it comes with a shroom lip balm and a good vibes only soft velvet primer so you know i'm going to order that i wonder if i pull it up can i show y'all on my screen right quick let's see soft velvet primer so that's what i'm gonna order that's my next thing to order yeah what were we talking about oh the concealer how did I get to Amazon? No. Did not say Amazon. And my phone so used to go to Amazon. It's probably like, that's where you're going. No, you won't tell me. I tell you. Okay. I'm coming, y'all. I'm coming, I'm coming, I'm coming. I'm coming, I'm coming, I'm coming. Okay, let's see. Mm, okay. Here we go. So it's called the I oh no camo color corrector. So I guess it's similar to like the concealers and whatnot. So the shade peach. I was trying to see. <clears throat> That's me know Peach color corrector camouflages spots and darkness found under the eyes in fair to medium skin tones. And why I got the reason why I got this is because even though I'm dark skinned African American woman of color, under my eye area is a lighter than the out outer part of my face. So let's just say I have dullness or darkness. I feel like I should be able to color correct with this. So this oh, it's thick. It's not thick, like thick, like applying it, like consistency thick, but it's pigmented i should say because i expected it to be like really really sheer so this is peach come on so this is the shade peach if i'm being honest i would use this as a lipstick for it let me use it for what it's intended for this is orange yeah that would use that for lipstick 
so we know orange is gonna be rocking and roll oh, yeah I need to play I need to play with that one for this dark spark I, I got right here to see if maybe it fixes that come on so that's orange and peach it's thick I'm gonna leave this on because I want to see how it dries is that everything guys I think I got one more thing for free and it's the lotion the same thing that goes with the toner it's the moisturizer the pure skin moisturizer with oat milk and ceramides ceramides plus niacinamide so those these were the two free gifts that I got yeah Okay guys, on to Ulta. I had to pick up a little a little bit of stuff. Just a little bit. Just a little bit. Just that's sad when you get like super duper excited because you got makeup. But that's where I'm at with this thing. Okay. It's gonna be real quick too. So the first thing I had to have, because I told you this haul was things that I had to have, it was no question. It's the real the new real techniques day gleam glossy glow foundation brush. And they were buy one, get one 50% off. So it's 080. First of all, I picked it up because of the color. I had to have it. You all know yellow is one of my top favorite colors the shape of this brush i don't even know if i know how to use this brush boy how much were they they were 16 dollars, so i got them for what eight dollars so let's see but i kind of figured that it would be you know not a bulky brush damn yes this is what i wanted Oh, it's so lightweight. Oh my gosh, yes. Pick this up, y'all. Y'all gonna need this brush right here. Y'all gonna need this. I promise you gonna need this. As you see the angle, you see the angle of it and the slant. Woo yeah, so this will be perfect for my foundation. Even with, I feel like if I wanna do concealer, like pressing my concealer, but yeah, this is gonna be perfect. It has a little twist right here, which gives it a little groove, but this is how it looks and y'all see from the side i love brushes with angles that has angles to them so yeah oh yeah don't be surprised if i need to pick up another one but yeah i got two of those got some more foundation brushes too these must be about one get one 50 percent out too so i picked up two of the ultra brushes in number 15 and this is a large paddle foundation brush looks like that and these were eight dollars i don't need no more brushes but i could not pass i think i got my scissors oh. let's see if i can get in here yeah I'm good. okay densely domed bristles provide full coverage for liquid or cream foundation premium synthetic hair and wood handle also collection makes a oh yes 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 these are similar it's similar to the one i just showed y'all the real techniques but different this one doesn't have a slant it's all the way slanted so this is how it looks the side the paddle and I'm going to show y'all let me pull it up on my phone right quick but I'm going to show y'all why I was so insisted I insisted insisted what did I do I insisted on getting this brush <sighs> this is another day I feel like talking hold on y'all I got y'all everything gonna be alright I probably deleted it. I didn't. Okay. This is a Bedellium Tool brush and it's $27. I have had it in my Save for Later cart and Amazon for the last probably four or five months. And I want to show y'all how it looks. I never could bring myself to pay $27 for this brush, but as you can see, this is how it looks. Let me see. Okay. 
and it looks just like the Real Techniques and the um, Ulta brush. The shape of it and everything, and it's $27. So that's the reason why I purchased these two brushes, only because I've had my eye on a similar brush like this for a while. So yeah, this is my Ulta brush. Next up, Essence came out with some new makeup, and I'm going to do a review on it, of course. But I wanted to show you all. We won't swatch it because you have to stay tuned for the review. I picked up Essence Keep Me Covered Concealer. It's a vegan, no fragrance, silicones, or mineral oil. And these were $4. $4. I hope the shade is on here. So I picked up the shade Mahogany number 190 golden tan we'll talk more about this once i do the video but this is how it looks i can go ahead and say my leg is going numb i can go ahead and say right now i just wish that essence would do better with their shade range provide more colors more undertones i really really enjoy essence cosmetics but i feel like they need to do better as far as a widening it, widening it, making their collection bigger, because I can't see it, obviously. And yeah, I'm gonna keep that part in here. Like it's just real. So I picked up their two foundations, new also from the same line, the Keep Me Covered Long Lasting Foundation. This only had 15 shades, okay? 15 shades is $6.99. Once again, this is no added parabens, silicones, or microplastic particles. It's a vegan uh, foundation. I picked up the shade 180 Mahogany and 200 Cocoyo. I would say cocoa, but somebody stuttered it said cocoa or cacao or cocoa or whatever. So these are the two shades. <sighs> yeah, y'all gonna have to wait for the review to see the way it's looking like I might have to mix them. They're $6.99. I really want to see how they perform on my skin. So yeah, these are the two shades. It ain't looking too good right now, but we're going to give it a go. So, yeah, stay tuned for that. And I got something free. Let's see. Not free because I paid for this stuff and they gave it to me. This is a... What is it? Oh. I like samples of foundation. So, the Morphe No Filter Foundation. The Estee Lauder. This skin loving care futuristic hydro rescue moisturizing makeup. What is this? I don't know. I probably I'm gonna should try it out though. I'm gonna read more about it if y'all can see. Let's see what this is. This is and the tint you know. This is nothing. Why did y'all make it seem like y'all was giving me the world? Y'all gave me nothing. This is Smashbox Halo Healthy Glow All-in-One Tinted Moisturizer and Tan Dark. We might have to try that too. I haven't tried anything for Smashbox in a while. And that's everything from Ulta. Last but not least, I picked up an order from Fenty. <laughs> Fenty. Sephora was all out. I picked up the new body butter. This is my first time trying the body butter. It was everywhere. And I was like, okay, then give it a try. This will be your first time. If you like it, you like it. If you don't, you don't. Then at least you can say you tried it. But everybody was saying how good the other releases were. I didn't realize that this was like a limited time. Like all the others, you can't purchase them now. They're gone. So yeah. So this is how it looks. It was $45. So not on the cheap side by no means got Fenty right there and vanilla dreamed whipped body oil cream I'm gonna use it tonight to see how I apply all over body once a day that's all it says okay then whatever hmm. okay let's see I did not open it okay, let's get the open oh it's got some stuff in there it's so tiny 
Uh, Rihanna, why you even put this in the hair? Because I can't. Love your skin. Respect the planet. Okay. Yeah. So, this like this. Let's see what it's doing. This is my first one. I got the... It smells like vanilla. A very light vanilla. Hmm. Vanilla mixed with something else though. I'm gonna use it. I'm gonna use it when I wash the night, so I don't want to go overboard. So let's take some from my top, rub it on my hand, see what we're working with. I saw some reviews and they were saying, you know, that it usually have like glitter in it or reflex in it or whatever. This is my first time, so I don't know nothing about that. It smells good. Will it be long lasting? Will I smell like vanilla for at least six or seven hours? That's a, my question. That's my only concern when I purchase perfume or body lotions or body oils. I just want to make sure that they are long lasting because that's really what you pay your money for. So I'll update you all, but right now it smells like vanilla to me. That's it. <laughs> I can't give y'all like in depth because this is my first time and I don't really know too much about it but I'll keep you all posted I also purchased this is my first time to the daily duo mini cleanser and a toner from I've been really into skincare lately as far as taking care of my skin trying new things uh, just as far as like toners and cleansers and moisturizers, just trying to make sure I stay on top of my skin. And this has been out for a while. I used to see reviews about this all the time. Never thought to try it, but we're going to give it a go. I'll probably do a skincare video so you all can see me use it to see how I like it. Is this better than e.l.f. or is e.l.f. you know, my still my go-to and what I need? But a moisturizer and a toner. Did I say moisturizer? No. A cleanser and a toner. And last but not least from Fenty is a gloss balm dip. Clip on lip luminizer. And I got it in the shade hot chocolate. I've always wanted hot chocolate. But I never broke down and purchased it. And I saw this and this had to be on sale because I know it was on sale. I was like, okay, well, it's the same thing. I just get a little tiny brush. Uh, this is a clip though. I'm kind of wondering like what you would just clip it in your pocketbook or something. Like where would you clip this? So yeah, so hot chocolate. And then open it. It's like this. Y'all know what hot chocolate look like. Come on. Now I want to focus. Y'all know where to focus. Beautiful brown shade. Beautiful brown shade. Ain't no sense in me trying to use my finger. No sense in me. Can I do it though? I'm gonna have to play with this when I get a like a makeup brush. I mean a lip brush to play with it. But yeah, I love chocolate anything. So when I saw a chocolate like lip gloss, I was all in for it. Y'all know that. And it's a clip. I still don't know where I'm gonna clip it at, but it's a clip. Right quick, guys. It was on the floor. I almost missed this. That I picked up a set of lashes from Alta by Kiss, and it's the MLBB the lash but bolder. 3D. I was trying to see. Oh, big personality. And this is how they look. They were $5.99 or either $7.99. I can't remember. They look okay, but I really always have a problem when a lash is like extra shiny. And to me, this is giving really shine. I like for my lashes to be like matte and like really hair-like. So we'll see. I, I Y'all know I always purchase my lashes from Amazon, but I decided to try something different and give these a go since they were new. So we'll check them out in a minute. All right, guys. So this is my short but long haul because I did more talking than I did hauling. 
but I hope you enjoyed it. Drop down and let me know if you have purchased any of these items. If you plan on purchasing purchasing any of these items, what are your thoughts? I think out of all the things I purchased, I'm most excited about those makeup brushes. Like I'm dying to use them. I wanted it that that shape. For so long that I'm dying to use them. So we'll be doing a video with video with that really, really soon. Make sure you like, comment, and subscribe. And I'll see you later. Bye guys.